All right, so we're back again. This is gonna be a two video series. So if you checked out the last video, you wanna stay tuned for this one. So don't click off this thing, all right? We got Dean Thomas back in the building. All right, you guys know who that is. And Aspen Lad is back, don't worry. She's tougher than she actually looks. She's look, she looks very innocent right now, but she will tear your head off, all right? So Dean, what are we doing today? Well, first off, I need some lotion. I don't got yeah, no lotion, but it's enough just punch in the bag. Yeah, I just that punch in the work. bag. My knuckles is a little ashy, so don't, you know, I know y'all gonna be laughing at that, but. <laughs> he licked them, he licked, yeah. he licked them. <laughs> <laughs> but so the goal in any fight, in its essence, are to get these two knuckles on that chin. That's it. If I can get these two knuckles on this chin with a straight arm, that is the goal. So I can work on doing that. So for right now, so like there's a couple of different ways to do it. I'm looking at hand placement, all right? Sometimes they say, put your hands up. People put their hands up like this, right here. So the hole is right down the middle. So I'm coming straight in. Boom. Boom. Now, if she adjusts to that and covers that hole, puts the hand here, now the hand is here, that takes away my path. So now, off of the jab, I'm gonna take a small step at about 45 degrees this way. Boom. And then there's that punch. Now, I don't care how big a person is. Oftentimes we say, oh, that person was too big, you know, that, and you know, they're too strong. The reality is, is if you hit somebody right, it doesn't matter how big they are. If, you get, if I hit her here, listen, if she hits me with these two knuckles right on my chin while I'm not prepared for it, I'm going out. It doesn't matter how big I am. Now, if I'm balled up like this and she hits me, I might not go out. But if she hits me just right with those knuckles, I'm going out. So she'll do it to me. She'll, the first time she'll come straight in. Now if I adjust and I'm here, she steps off, bam! Bam! But put them two knuckles on the chin. I promise you, it'll work. All right, so there you have it, the two knuckles. Most important, right? You're gonna set it up depending on where your opponent is, and again, you wanna to get to that chin, so is that correct? Yeah, so I mean, can I just say this too? What? So like oftentimes we'll see somebody hit, you'll hit somebody as hard as you can, but you probably hit them with like this part of your fist, or hit them with this part of your fist, and it's not gonna do the same damage because it's not connected to the chain. It has to be connected to the chain. These two knuckles, not any other part of your fist, those are what have to make contact. We call that stacking, by the way. Kinetic linkage. Stacking, like what I call, I get paid. You get paid like this? Nah, I'm just kidding. Okay, all right. I was about to say, you're gonna have to get paid for this one. All right, guys, so there it is. Check out Aspen Lad. Check out the live train that we're doing too as well. That's coming out soon. And check out my man, Dean Thomas, ESPN, ESPN Radio. What up? Serious, I'm all over the place. You can't get rid of me. Yep, I can't, I can't. I've, I've known him for too long, yeah. I can't get rid of him. All right, make sure you subscribe to the notification, hit the like button, because I know you're gonna like this video. See you again next time, peace.